it'd be interesting to see what happens here. You know, there's a bit, there is some demand here. That's a, one of the best buying bars we've seen for a while. I would expect to see something. But that will give me a lot of information, though, Roman. Because if we, if we knife through this level, we don't even have any kind of bounce, then, you know, that's, that's give me a, a lot of information. Uh, oh, but how, it... how about this? They come out today or tomorrow and they say, like, you know what? We actually found the solution, which I doubt just because of the how, who they are. Uh, but there could be a possibility just like of a smaller like spring below this level and then more consolidation into June 1st and then the breakout. It could be much flatter. It could yes. come to this level. It could break like Microsoft and have that trap. So there are quite a few bullish scenarios right here. And again, it dependent on what? Does it depend on earnings? No. Does it depend on the economy? No. It depends on the uh, politics. And with politics, how do you know? You don't. So mm. what's the best strategy during that time? It's in the increase of volatility. Therefore, go to the lower time frame and pick up, you know, some dollars just on that time frame. Mm -hmm. And if it gives us that kind of like a bullish trap right here, right? Then you have an opportunity for a swing and campaign trades uh, to establish and to go into leading stocks that are just like too costly right now to participate in. So yeah. this could be a really interesting opportunity like it was here. 